Hello, this is Dan Alford with Arc Specialties. Today we're going to talk about sand screens. This is a technology that's been developed to filter the sand from oil wells. Rewind 30 years ago and I was working on these sand screen machines here in Houston. While I was doing this, I thought I had some better ideas and so 20 years ago we started to build our own sand screen machines and that's a story unto itself. 100 wells per second and attempting to hold plus or minus 1,000th accuracy on the gap. Today's topic is how do you actually measure that gap? Traditionally, this has always been done with feeler gauges, but with hundreds of gaps per foot and 40 foot long screens that have to be measured in four different quadrants, there's thousands of measurements to be made. It's a tedious job and it was just ripe for automation. So the way we tackled automation of measuring these sand screen gaps is using a TDI line scan camera. TDI line scan cameras are extremely accurate. We're measuring down to two and a half microns, which is 90 millionths of an inch. It's good engineering practice to measure 10 times as accurately as you're going to record. So we're trying to measure down to a thousandth of an inch, and we're a little over an order of magnitude better than that. So what we're doing is using this line scan camera, we scan down the length of this sand screen, possibly built on one of our machines, possibly on a competitor's. What we're doing is we're measuring every one of these gaps and then recording it. Then you can actually export this report to some spreadsheet. Then you can do histograms with statistical analysis. In this histogram, you can see we have 99.6% of the gaps are all plus or minus one thousandths of an inch. 99.9 .9 are plus or minus two thousandths of an inch. This may or may not be acceptable, but now we have the data and it's done quickly and automatically. So when you're doing optical metrology down to microns, which are millionths of a meter, you have to control all your variables. One of the most critical is camera height. So we float the camera over the part using laser displacement transducers. We servo the whole machine because not only do we need to know the gaps between each of the wraps, we need to know where these measurements were made. We even have to keep the camera at a constant temperature in order to maintain these tolerances. We've just finished commissioning this machine and it's about to be shipped overseas. The sand screen industry is interesting to me because we build the entire factory all the way from cutting the ribs to wrapping and welding the wire to this inspection machine, which is the final step. Look forward to us posting additional blogs on the rest of the equipment required to build a screen factory. Arc Specialties thrives on problems. Send us yours.